Hey guys, it's Mr. Howith. I am going to show you today how to find your own resources on Smart Music, okay? Uh, this is a really cool program with pretty much unlimited resources. So if you are kind of bored, uh, you want to play more than the assignments that we give you per week, you can absolutely do that on your own. It's really easy. Um, for example, you have this all these music categories right here, and I mean you, you can find anything in there. So a lot of your assignments, I just click on this stuff and I go find the stuff that I want you to play. You can do this too. So right now what I'm going to show you is this band stuff. So I'm going to click on band and orchestra, okay? You want to filter it for band pieces if you're just going to search through the list and find some stuff. So right here you'll see it says concert band, I filtered it. So all the pieces that I see here are concert band pieces. There's 167 pages worth of music. Okay, over here you have the difficulty signs. Now, um, high school students, you could probably do some of the reds. Middle school, I, I would stick to maybe the yellows and greens, okay? For sure, greens. You could probably, most of us can play the greens really easily, all right? All right. I already know which song I want to show you guys. So we'll check this out, Blue Ridge Real, Brian Balmages. You may recognize that name, high school students. We just played a song by that, all right? So I'm gonna open this up. Uh, so you see it shows percussion automatically, right? I'm just gonna pick a different one. Uh, let's do flute, okay? And I'll do flute one, open it up. This is really cool because um, it gives you your sheet music. You can play along on your part and you can have the opportunity to hear everything else that's happening in the band, so it's super awesome. Okay, so here we go. Um, now, if you want to just listen to it first, you want to turn my part on. I like to turn the metronome off, um, you, but you can leave it on if you want. And then you hit play. Notice it's in cut time. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So you hear, I can hear the flute part really well, right? If I turn it off, I don't hear it so much anymore, right? So that's that. Um, over here, you can change the tempo. So if that's too fast for me, and I wanted to, I needed to kind of practice it a little slower. I can change tempo to eighty, and it it changes the speed of the pieces. So you don't have to learn it. You don't have to learn it all at the marked tempo if that's if it's too fast for you, right? Um, and that's a really cool thing about it. So you want to make sure you take the time and practice everything correctly. You can do this with anything. Jazz students can find jazz band pieces you can play along with. You can find method books on how to improvise for jazz bands. I mean, there's tons of materials. So um, that is your tutorial on how to access additional materials if you're looking for them. Okay, I know some of you guys are probably missing playing a lot. So here's how you can play full band pieces in the comfort of your own home. See you guys.